In this video, I'll show you how to install Java JDK 21 in Visual Studio Code and how to create and run your first Java project in VS Code. First, go to your browser and go to this URL. I'll have this in the link in the description below. You can copy it from there. Now scroll down and you'll see these options here. So first of all, I am on Java JDK 21. So you can change your JDK version if you want. But for this tutorial, we will use JDK 21. Now scroll down and you can choose your OS you're installing for Windows, Mac or Linux. I'll choose Windows. And now next to this x64 installer, click on this link and your download will start. Let's wait till the download is completed. Once the download is complete, click on open file and your installation wizard will open. If you are asked do you want to allow this app to make changes to your device, click on yes. Finally, the installation wizard is open. Now click on next. This is where your Java will be installed. If you don't have storage left here, you can just click on change and go to any directory that you want. But for now, I'll just click cancel and I will let it install in the default directory. Now click next and the installation has started. Now click close. And finally, our Java has installed. To verify if Java is installed or not, you can press your Windows key and type CMD. You can open command prompt and type java double dash version and as you can see we have installed java 21 successfully now let's open our visual studio code and create our first java project and install the necessary extensions for java press your windows key and type vs code or visual studio code and open visual studio code and my old project is opening here so in your case you will see something like this now Click on this explorer and as you can see you already see these options create java project and all that stuff but first let's install the necessary extension so that we can format our java code properly so click on this extensions or the shortcut is Control shift x and then search for java extension pack now there are a lot of options available but you need to install this one from microsoft click on this and in the publisher you should see Microsoft now I already have it installed so it is giving me uninstall option so let me uninstall this and install this again in your case you will just see this install option so click on install and it will be installed for your Visual Studio code now it is successfully installed as you can see from this message here now go to your Explorer or enter the keys Control shift E and then this will open now click on create Java project and just click on no build tools for now and now we can choose where do we want to save our project so I'll just save it somewhere okay let's save it here and let now give a name to the project let's call it my first Java project now hit enter and all these folders will be automatically created for you and if you're asked do you want to trust the authors of this file just click yes now a readme.md file a sources folder and a library folder will be automatically created for you what you can do is this is not of any use for now you can just delete this if you want okay now we will do our code inside this app.java so as you can see a hello world is already created and there is a class called app and this public static void main function is already created by VS Code automatically. Now in order to run this, you can just go to run and click on run without debugging. Now as you can see, hello world is printed and we can do other stuff here. Let's call it int a equals to 21, 31 and we can do stuff like print instead of that we can just do a by 2 so we can do all this stuff now go to run and click on run without debugging again and this time as you can see 15 is printed and this is how you can install and set up java in visual studio code if you have any questions let me know in the comments below